Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. So I'm going to do a traveling tree ring today. And this is one of my, I'm kind of having a bad day. I'm going to just do whatever the heck I want videos. <laughs> um, some days I'm just like, I just need to go paint. Because I'm letting people get to me and I shouldn't. Anyways, um, so I'm using here white. This is a teal. I understand that it looks blue. Um, but there are different forms of teal, you guys. There are ones that are more green, ones that are more blue. Um, teal is basically like a really dark turquoise or a darker turquoise. Anyways, whatever. I'm not even going to argue about that. Um, these are all Artist Loft Flow Acrylics, except for this gold is the Deco Art Extreme Sheen 24 Karat Gold. Now, as you can see, even just the reaction in my cup, it causes cells. So I'm kind of excited about that to see the reactions that I'm gonna get from that. And um, this is a 10 by 20 canvas, which needs more than this amount of paint, most likely. So I may have to add some around the sides, but basically I'm going to do just a really fun traveling, wandering tree ring. I'm going to go ahead and just actually add some more paint to the cup. Try to do the same-ish sequence. Yellow. So I could add it around the side, but I think I'd rather do this. That should be enough. So look at all those really cool cells forming. Now I don't wouldn't normally use something that causes cells in a tree ring pour, but I definitely wanted this one to be a little more funky. So I'm not mad at those cells there. And I'm going to just help the paint flow along the edges here. I like to kind of control the edges as much as possible rather than tilting more than needed. I try to avoid tilting just to get the canvas covered. All right. And guys, I hope you are all having a fantastic month. May is almost over at the time I'm recording this video. Soon to be June. Warmer weather. Okay. Well, isn't this exciting? I really like this and I like the no plan just kind of go with the flow pouring because you can create something really cool and unexpected let's let this sit here I'm curious if that gold is going to be developing some more cells and then we'll do our close-up okay we're back so definitely some, a little bit of cells popping up, but not too much. And I think it's pretty much going to stay like this. And I just, I couldn't be more than happier. I don't even know if that sentence makes sense. I couldn't be more happier, I think, is actually what I was trying to say. Anyways, this was very relaxing and stress relieving. And I'm going to now go have some blueberry pancakes. But first, I'm going to go ahead and bring y'all in for a close up. Okay, starting on the lower right hand corner. I love this. I love how it kind of came out pretty earthy. Um, except for this kind of big pop of yellow up here, but that's okay. Still awesome. But look over here. This looks like some gorgeous stone that comes down through here. I love it. I think it's great. Don't forget to check the materials for the, dis uh, blah, 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 the description for the materials. 
Um, no silicone in this. And all of the paints are Artist Loft Flow Acrylics, except for the gold, which is Deco Art Extreme Sheen, 24 karat gold. And I also have a link in the description for my silicone bowls and mat that I use. So there we go. Okay, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this. Thank you so much for watching and joining me and supporting and everything. Love and appreciate all of you, and I will see you all next time.